Hey, healthcare heroes, you're doing an incredible job helping patients with emotional instability. Discover in our new YouTube series, explore hypnotherapy techniques for managing mood disorders like bipolar. For example, imagine visualizing holding two imaginary weights, one your anger, the other your strength. Your patients will feel more in control and better equipped with this simple visual exercise to handle their mood swings. Here's a kinesthetic example. As you relax deeply, imagine that you're holding two large imaginary weights in your hands. One represents anger and the other represents your strength. Picture yourself adjusting the weights, making the anger lighter, the strength stronger. Notice how with practice you gain better control over these emotions. This technique helps you balance your emotional states more effectively. Here's an imagery technique. For example, visualize a balloon floating high in the sky, representing your emotional highs. When you're feeling elevated, imagine this balloon is gently guiding you through the highs. Now, if they're too high, picture an anchor anchored firmly to the ground, symbolizing stability. Whenever you feel your mood dropping or rising too high, visualize this anchor holding you steady, providing support and balance. These kinesthetic techniques have been notably effective in reducing emotional turmoil and enhancing therapeutic engagement for patients with mood disorders. For instance, a patient with bipolar disorder reported significant improvements in managing their emotional responses and achieving a sense of balance through this method. Similarly, the imagery technique has provided patients with practical ways to stabilize their moods, leading to improved self-confidence and emotional control. Both techniques utilize the principles of focused attention and emotional anchoring. By redirecting attention and creating controlled emotional states, patients can manage their effective instability more effectively. The logical foundation lies in conditioning and anchoring emotional responses to specific cues, thereby enhancing self-regulation. You can catch the full series on YouTube. Remember to like, subscribe or comment, ask questions. Goodbye for now and remember to be a little kinder to yourself because you're perfect just as you are.